lobbies at CES has been to harass the vendors about why there are no USB-C to Thunderbolt or DisplayPort adapters. And so I tortured Richard Lang here at uh, Canex about it, and he gave me the best answer, which is that there's uh, it's been Intel that hasn't been certifying people yet to do that. But you've got a product that's coming out in uh, hopefully looking first quarter for that, right? Oh uh, yes, for, for, uh, hopefully uh, looking at toward the end of the first quarter. And what we have currently available uh, on the, at demo right now is a uh, Thunderbolt 3 legacy adapter, which is uh, which is compatible to all Thunderbolt 2 devices. All right, and Thunderbolt 2 can carry uh, DisplayPort, so it would work. Right. It would work. The problem I keep trying to solve is I've got a thousand dollar MacBook with a thousand dollar Apple monitor, and I can't plug the two in together. But anyway, but we want to talk about something more exciting that you're actually uh, sure. getting a lot of sure. uh, excitement about today. What do you got here? So uh, what we have here is a uh, Apple Watch battery. Uh, it's a 4,000 million battery, uh, has a also additional USB-A port to charge iPhone or your iPad devices. And that's a uh, and, uh, uh, mic micro USB port to recharge the battery. Okay. So uh, let's just do a quick demo with Alice's watch. So place your watch here and then press the button. And there it is, it's charging. 71% charge. Wow, when I don't that's exercise, that, yeah, no, that's not fast, Steve. When I don't exercise, I notice the battery lasts a longer, lot longer. So for the audio listeners, this is about maybe two and a half by two and a half inches and an inch thick, and uh, it's portable. Uh, how many mil milliamp hours is that? 4,000 milliamp. Oh, that's a lot. So you could do your phone and your watch, a little you bit of both? You your phone your watch uh, at the same time. And also, uh, some people ask me uh, the question that, what if I'm recharging the battery and then try to charge the external devices at the same time, what will happen? Uh, what's going to happen is uh, the battery will allow the power to pass through to charge your, uh, your iPhone, iPad, or your watch first. Oh, great, great, great. Before the battery is being recharged. Okay, so cool. So you could just throw one of these in your, in your bag and you don't have to worry about finding a power right. outlet. So what is this product going to be called? Uh, we haven't really uh, finalized on the name yet. But uh, most likely it's going to be just a uh, Apple Watch battery. Okay, and do what time frame? Uh, end of Q1. All right, fantastic. Any pricing on that yet? Uh, it's going to be 70, uh, 70, 99.95. Sorry. Okay. All right. All right. Well, for people who've spent so much money on a watch, it's a good deal, I think. Well, thank you very much, Richard. This is fantastic. People can find more at uh, connects.com, and that's K-A-N-E-X.com. Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you.